so glad you're here. Thank you. You haven't been here in a while. I can't come if you don't come. <laughs> I guess that's true. Well, we haven't been here in a while, but I'm really, really happy to see you. I know that you're glad to be here, too. I am. Mean, so, hey, what? Clear and easy. Two, the talking guy. The what? The talking guy. Oh, you mean Pastor Neil. Uh -huh. Oh, he's the talking guy. Uh -huh. <laughs> What's Thomas? He's the singing guy. Oh, so Neil is the talking guy, uh -huh. and Thomas is the singing guy. Uh -huh. What does Steve do? Nobody knows. <laughs> <laughs> and that works just fine. <laughs> Who's making him talk? Oh, stop. So... <laughs> So anyway, we're really, really, really happy to be here today. So how's school, school going? You don't want to know. Oh, you're having a hard time. I am. It's horrible. Well, well you know, I thought we kind of might talk about that today. Okay, okay. You know, the, the good thing is tomorrow is a holiday. Uh -huh. So um, then you'll be fresh and ready to go back on Tuesday. I have to go back? Yes. I don't need to go back. Why not? I learned everything. <laughs> you did not learn everything. So I thought, Lee, I brought your uh, school list. We could see uh, the kids who are in your class. Okay, let's see. Mason, Logan, Caliber, Stetson, Scorpio, Caden, Jaden, Caden, Peyton, Paris, Brooklyn, and Kennedy. Uh -huh. Where are the girls' names? Those are the girls' names. <laughs> what happened to all the Nancys? They're in the nursing home. <laughs> So the boys are, let's see, Jackson, Braxton, Colby, Keegan, Culver, Cordite, Deshaun, Trey Kevin, and Grass. Uh -huh. There's a boy in your class named Grass. Uh -huh. I am so old. I could have told their dad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, honey. Um, see, I, I wanted to bring this up because there's going to be a new girl in your class. There's, yeah. A, a, a girl that you already know that's being uh, transferred in. Who? Cornucopia. Oh, just kill me. <laughs> I know she's horrible. Now don't say she's awful. Now stop. Don't say that. She, she, she called me a bad name. We remember. She made fun of me on the playground. We remember that too. She killed my Barbie. <laughs> yes, we remember that too. Well, the reason I'm bringing this up is because today our uh, our verse and our verse of scripture is about a prophet. Do you know what prophet means? Making money? <laughs> Not that kind of prophet. The kind of prophet who told us what God said. What did he say? Well, he said a whole lot of things. But see, in, in Ezekiel, he's warning us to turn away from our wicked ways. Like turn away from our wicked ways. Isn't that the Wizard of Oz? No, you're thinking of the wicked wisdom, the wet, wicked, wet, easy thing you to say. <laughs> Anyway, we're talking about turning away from our wicked ways. And so, you see, since cornucopia is going to be in your class, I'm here to warn you. Maybe you should warn her. <laughs> well, I'm not her mother, so I'm going to warn you. Here's what happened in Ezekiel. Ezekiel was warning people that they needed to do the right thing. They needed to listen to the voice of God no matter where it came from. Uh, so um, sometimes, you see, we can't change other people's hearts, but we can help them do the right thing by warning them about what might happen if they don't do the right thing. I see. Okay, so here's what I want from you this year. I want you to be kind and considerate and loving and respectful and responsible. That's an awful lot. I know, but I think you're up to it. Okay, so when you hear the scripture today from Ezekiel, who was the prophet, Think about what happens when we're warned about doing the wrong thing. Okay, let's pray. Okay, okay close your eyes. Everybody, close down your head. Close your eyes. Say this prayer after me. Thank you, God. Thank you, God, for people who help us, for people who help us know what's right to do. Know what's right to do. Amen. 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 See you all later.